Hi Taurus, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Taurus, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Taurus. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck we have the magician and this is mercury energy gemini virgo energy so this is a card of manifesting and um, trying to achieve your desired outcome using your own strengths like this is a very proactive type of manifesting so you could be trying to win someone over or impress them or someone is doing this to you um, but you are manifesting what you want in love you're like taking control of a situation okay so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say Okay, we have the Empress, Venus energy. We have the Six of Wands, Fire energy, and we have the Two of Pentacles, Earth energy. Yeah, there's this feeling of attracting someone here. Yeah? Um, you know, someone who is being viewed as the Empress. Um, this could be you who's being viewed this way because we do have Venus energy with the Empress. Um, someone really wants you. And there's this feeling of um, wanting to, like doing what it takes to, to get you, to win you over. Um, they are putting you on a bit of a pedestal. Um, something could be becoming like official, some sort of recognition with the Six of Wands. Um, but there's a victory here. There's this feeling of... Um, you and someone coming together and people seeing you guys or identifying you guys as a couple and it looks like this is someone you want to be seen with you know there's this feeling of a win in love um a successful outcome they they're really going out of their way to show you that you are a priority this is someone who's really um you know making way for you make, making space in their life for you because they that's how much they value they do see you as someone very special and you are a priority to them let's clarify these cards taurus Okay, so we have the the Queen of Swords, and this is Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. So, yeah, this is a card of someone who is um, really wanting to be upfront with you, like making things clear, um, no sugarcoating. You and this person are identifying where you guys stand with each other. Again, they're coming correct here. So you could be having some sort of negotiation with this person, which is leading to something being recognized or put forward or expressed. So let's see. Okay, we have a High Priestess, Pisces Energy, Three of Pentacles, Earth Energy, and the Hanged Man in the Reverse, Earth Energy. No, Pisces Energy. So with the, the High Priestess, they, they someone has held back a lot when it came to their feelings. And this was strategic with the magician here. It's because they did feel like it gave them an upper hand in the connection. But there's this feeling of um, taking a more direct approach now because there's this, this feeling of it's time. You know, it's it, the someone is ready. They're ready to make a sacrifice to be in this connection, and they're ready to collaborate to work on this together, to be a team, to have something, to build something with a firm foundation that can last a long time. Okay, so I'm gonna pull out an oracle card for you, um, Taurus. have the end of the tough cycle approaches full moon in capricorn yeah something is finally at this illumination stage with the six of wands there's a victory in love for you okay so i'm going to put another card okay we have past life relationship you have known each other before so you and this person do have a very strong bond there's a lot of chemistry and a soul tie even here okay so i'm gonna put another card
Okay, we have honeysuckle. Domestic happiness and devoted affection. I will win thee in my arms. So dark the woodbine, the honeysuckle gently in twist. Yeah, it looks like you guys are coming into some sort of stability in this connection. Like something is becoming more defined. You guys could be talking about the terms of the relationship. Um, or you're going public with this. Like you're you're going official. You're introducing each other to friends and family. Or coming out as a couple. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, um, Taurus. Okay, we have surrender worry make a commitment not to lead an anxiety driven life when worries arise breathe them out of your body focus on the power of your heart and have faith that spirit is guiding you always okay so that's what i'm seeing for you taurus i hope you have a really really good day taurus bye taurus